I am about to take Benadryl because my face is itching like crazy. I had a shoot yesterday and I guess I was allergic to the makeup they used on me. Um, but my face is itching so bad. I don't know if you guys can see right here, but I'm developing some sort of like rash um, on my cheeks. So, oh, really itching. So I'm just gonna take Benadryl to see if it goes away. If not, I'm gonna have to see my dermatologist again very soon. So, um, yeah, it's itching so bad. My eyes are itching. Right here is itching. Just basically, spots on my face is itching like crazy. Um, on a brighter note, today is Mother's Day. We just had um, a Mother's Day lunch with my family. I came home to visit my family. Um, I think. We're gonna go to my brother's house in a little bit and um, visit baby Mason. Arnold is actually buying me a milk tea um, drink because I was craving it, so he's buying it for me. Oh no, my camera is dying. So finally, after one month, my bed finally arrived. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. So Arnold and I are going to try an and- attempt. Yes, <laughs> the keyword is attempt. We're going to try build it ourselves. So Arnold is, this is the bed rail, yes. and right over here, we have the headboard. So I'm really excited to um, put everything together. Oh, and this is my mattress. So, yeah, I'm very excited. Okay, so I should start helping Arnold now, I guess. Right? No? Oh, oh someone's gonna cry. We've never done this before. Have you ever tried building a bed? Um, no, I only build Legos. Oh, well you have somewhat of a, you have somewhat of an experience then if you've built Legos, right love? No, what's wrong with you today? <laughs> <laughs> we've never done this before and we figured we'd film it for you guys and see how it goes. <laughs> Alright, two hours later, <laughs> we finally, <laughs> we finally unwrapped it's this done, part. Man. man, it's taking a while to unwrap these. They did pretty... Good job wrapping all of these. So I'm assuming these are the um, the metal thingies that goes on the side. <sighs> Not really sure what the proper terms are, but yes, I'm right. The thingy majiggy and Arnold right there. He's been working on that for about Five an hours. hour. Five hours. Now. Here you go, sir. We only have one cutter, so this? we can. <laughs> you draw on it, right? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, check out my tweets, you guys. How awesome is this? So I got this from Target. My brother actually hates it because he thinks he, he thinks not, they're not real tools. Yeah, they think he thinks I wasted my money. I think I did not waste my money because I mean it's pink. Although I don't recommend it. They're they're pretty weak tools. <laughs> oh, you opened it. What's inside? The thingy. Cups. <laughs> <laughs> I hope they have instructions inside. Mm, we'll see. It's not looking like they left us instructions, huh, no. Lovey? Are you serious? Oh my Maybe gosh. Maybe on there? No? Nothing there? Doubt it. And they opened everything. No! No instructions? No instructions. Oh my gosh. Well, this is gonna be a disaster. <laughs> Hold up, I think I found the instructions no right way. here. No yep, way. I think so. You see it? Right there? Oh, yep. There it is. It's right there. Why would they put it there? There was so much space inside that box. I know. Hi, they wanted guys. to spook us. <laughs> well, we were spooked. Thanks, guys. Yes! Oh. The magic tool! Well, it's just paper, but it's the most magical. important thing in here. Ooh, so far so good. <laughs> we have um, the bed rails up. We have the feet and everything. We even have like this thing in the middle. So, almost done. Yeah. So, we have to attract attach we have to attach those um those things next to arnold and then headboard. the headboard right over here here is the bed um obviously there's something missing um i completely forgot that i had to get a bed spring for it so um yeah so i can't sleep here i can't sleep on my bed tonight because um yeah i need that bed Ugh, the thing that goes underneath. Um, but yeah, so hopefully tomorrow everything gets fixed. Um, but this is what it looks like. I'm so excited. I've always wanted a bed frame like this. 
um, ever since I moved into my old place, which was two years ago. But um, yeah, I finally decided to get one. Hi guys! So today I am spending the entire day with Kristen. We're at Universal Studios. Check that out, you guys. It's pretty, it's pretty packed today, but we're hoping to have an awesome day because we got the front of the line. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we forgot. Um, we're good. We forgot the map, but I think we're good. Oh, okay. I've been here a few times, and it's our first time. <laughs> yeah. Yay. It's very hot today, though. So hopefully, it won't be. Hopefully, we'll survive. I haven't been here in so long. I feel like they've done like a but. Oh. Do you want to say hi to him? No. no. <laughs> Kristen doesn't like Scooby Doo, apparently. There's Shrek. Hi, Shrek. Hello, young lady. There's a line for Shrek. How you doing? What's up? <laughs> and donkeys right Hello. there. Everyone remain calm. Just a tiny little tremor. We get from time to time. Nothing to worry about, I promise. Whoa. Okay, uh, medium. Medium sized tremor. Still nothing to worry about. Just stand outside. We will ride this out. Oh, oh no. Oh no, this is not a medium tremor, you guys. This is it. This is the big one. Okay, if you were here with a loved one, now would be a very good time to forget them and save yourself. Focus your camera on one side of the street. We're going to come back up the same way. On your left, that beige house belonged to Gabrielle Solis. Also on your left, this yellow and stone house belonged to Susan Delfino. Across the street on your right, the blue and brick house belonged to Bree Vandekamp. Back on your left, the house with the picket fence belonged to Tom and Lynette Scavo. During season one of Desperate Housewives, Wisteria Lane actually ended right about here. For Car Hi, Norman! Yeah, he's gonna like that a lot. He's gonna like that a lot, you guys. He doesn't get a lot of friends out here. <gasps> Look at that, he's helping that lady to her car! Not a lot of innkeepers do that these days. Chivalry is not dead at the Bates Motel. Wow. What's it going, Norman? What's going on? You're acting creepy. Ooh. Okay, you know what, Steve? We better get out of here. Uh, uh, okay, uh, you know what? Um, ooh, gosh. Uh, okay, Steve. Uh, we better go. Uh, Norman, you can take car four. Car four is all yours, Norman. Car four. They said some bad stuff about your mom. So cool. What is it, though? Oh, it's a t-shirt inside. Oh, my gosh. Donut pillows. Yes. Oh, my gosh. They have holes. Oh. Hey, Mommy, run. Are you excited? I'm excited. <laughs> There's only a 20-minute wait, so... This should be pretty easy. So I guess it wasn't the bright idea to ride the Jurassic Park ride because now we're all wet. I don't know if you guys can see my shirt, but it's like soaking wet. Just a random guy bullying this kid right here. <laughs> so this is Groose. Oh, so 